Hi, I'm here to talk about the R4 multi-purpose screw from GRK Fasteners. It's a patented screw and like all of GRK's fasteners it has a six point star drive head which means that you have six points where the bit engages the screw unlike four with a Phillips or a square drive fastener. That means that you're far less likely to slip out of the screw head and scratch the coating. You have several patented features on this screw. First of all there's the brand new redesigned underhead of the screw which used to have just cutting pockets which was a patented feature. Now in addition to that you have cutting teeth in the pockets which is the new patented underhead design of the R4. With this it allows the fastener to be countersunk in any material and you can even run it through something as brittle as arborite or melamine without cracking the surface. The screw can be run into pretty much anything without pre-drilling. You have a CEE thread on the screw here which helps to widen the screw hole and accommodate uh, the head going into the wood and it also helps the two pieces of wood or two pieces of material that you're combining to settle more freely. Then you have a patented thread design on the screw called a W cut which is a feature like this that reduces the torque and resistance when the screw is being driven because it acts like a saw blade. The finish on the screw is something called Climatech which is a triple zinc polymer coating that is unique to GRK and is fully compatible with pressure treated lumber. I will show the screw here going into hardwood. This is a piece of black ash. I have a piece of pressure treated lumber right behind it as well as some melamine over here and I'll demonstrate the screw in all of these materials. First I'll start off with black ash. Next we'll go into pressure treated lumber. Now into melamine. I'll also show you that you can use the R4 screw here because of its features such as the thread and the head design to put it very close to the edge of a board without splitting the wood. I've marked a spot here on this 4x4 of pressure treated lumber which is approximately a quarter inch away from the edge and without having pre-drilled this I will put the screw into the wood and it will not split the wood. Just to show you that the R4 is a true multi-purpose screw which can not only be used in all kinds of woods or melamine, I'll also show you that it can be installed effortlessly into things like cement fiberboard and through metal studding. I'll start with cement fiberboard. move on to the metal studding. I'll also show you something on the R4 multi-purpose screw here uh, which has to do with the strength of the steel. We harden the screws in such a way that it's next to impossible to actually strip out the screw head. Uh, in a lot of instances with competitor screws there's a lot of skipping and slipping in the head going on which of course will damage the coating and if that happens on an R4 the coating here will be damaged too but you are not going to have to screw spin out on you or actually strip out on you which means then you then have to take pliers to get the screw back out. Here the screw head will not strip out you can still fully install the fastener or remove it from whatever material you put it in. I've put this screw about halfway into pressure treated lumber now and now I'll attempt to spin it out on purpose or strip it out, sorry.
You cannot strip this out. Now I'll in install it and I'll countersink it as well. You can take it back out again too.